Well, located in the panhandle of Oklahoma, Seaboard Farms is best known as the leading pork producer in the U.S. And now they're cutting the fat and turning it into high-grade biodiesel. Our Lisa Hines was there as they turned on the tap. All right, this plant is now officially open. With the cutting of the red ribbon, the new High Plains biodiesel plant is now open for business. And according to Oklahoma Secretary of Agriculture, Terry Peach, it's good for our state. Oh, this is tremendous for Oklahoma. This is the kind of projects that Oklahoma agriculture and rural Oklahoma has been looking for for several years. A subsidiary of Seaboard Farms, the plant will be able to produce 30 million gallons of biodiesel annually. And according to Seaboard Foods President Rod Brenneman, this will add value to Seaboard's pork processing. What it's going to do is not only um, produce renewable energy, which obviously is one of our commitments in business, but it's also going to hopefully add to our bottom line. I mean, we certainly do this for economic reasons as well as renewable energy reasons. It will also be good for the Panhandle area. It's going to add jobs. We've got 30 to 35 jobs. It's going to add tax base to the state of Oklahoma. And for the Guymon region, you know, incremental development like this in value-added agriculture is going to be a huge positive. Using a state-of-the-art process, they produce biodiesel from animal fat, about a pound of pig fat to make a gallon of fuel. We're able to take byproduct from our processing plant, which actually has been converted from grain to meat, meat into bright byproducts and um, the byproducts then are converted into a renewable energy resource. A natural resource that plant manager Bob White says is also better for the environment. So this really improves the, the value of something that was once a, a waste stream, a low, low value stream for them, and it uh, also improves the environment, and uh, they're, they're very much committed to doing that. This product that we come out of this plant uh, is able to be able to burn in any, any vehicle, that's, any diesel vehicle that's on the road today. Uh, you have to make no adjustments, you have to make no altercations. If you have a diesel engine, you can burn biodiesel. It's a clean burning, renewable fuel, now available at love stations in Oklahoma.